I'm in Peckham today to ask people, how's your mental health? Can I ask you a quick question? No. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a question? How's your mental health? Mm. Yeah? Feel good? Um, how is your mental health? Uh, okay, uh, I presume, yeah, it's all right. What, what makes you presume that? Um, <laughs> how is your mental health? It has ups and downs, but it's all right. It's always going to have ups and downs, but it's not too bad. Uh, my mental health right now, I've been quite stressed lately, now that everything reopened, so I've been a bit overwhelmed with work. Mm. But I'm doing, I've been doing roller skating and meditation and praying a lot, going to church in order to, uh, to feel better. Oh, mine is not that good, but in, with time, you know, you never know you have mental health until it comes to you. Mm -hmm. You know, it's not physical. Mm -hmm. You don't see mental health, do you? Mm -mm, no. no. What's your name? Angela. Oh, no, thank you for stopping, Angela. I'm just asking people today, how is your mental health? Poor. How is your mental health? Uh, I don't know, like, as a teenager, you know, it varies. Like, school, figure out what you want to do next, life, this is a bit all over the place at times. Mm. Do you know what I mean when we speak about mental health? I think people that's got problems, depressed, depression, anxiety, anxiety and all that, yeah. trauma. Do you feel like praying helps with your mental health? That's why prayer is there, to keep you fit, body-wise. Uh, it's all a body exercise and plus mentally, spiritually, everywhere. I think because I, I was brought up in the church, it does help me a lot because I believe that someone's out there to help make a difference. Mm. Do you feel like religion has helped you? Or having a, fa having a faith? It depends on the day that I... Yeah, it helps, but you know, it's still there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you pray to God just to help you get by it. Mm -hmm. It's still there. A lot's been happening in life. Yeah since the pandemic. Have you had some personal losses? Mm. Um, mm -hmm. My best friend, I thought she was a happy person. I thought everything was good and then one day she sat me down and she was like, rah, so, 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 so. And I was just like, shit, like, this stuff actually happens. Mm. How is your mental health? Um, actually, well, my mental health is in a much better place because I'm now much more self-aware. Right. So I know when I'm, getting low and I know the things that I need to do to get myself back up again. Is there anything that you've been doing to help yourself? I'm just going through the doctors Yeah. and they say to get out and yeah. walk Yeah. and that's what I'm doing at the moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, self staycations and stuff like that, self spa days yeah. and also checking in on your friends mm -hmm. and stuff. Being to watch the TV and just try not to like get within in my head really. Yeah. What do you do when it's down? compartmentalize what you do just find little, little little get yourself little goals so tick stuff off that you need to do do things that make you happy do you ever journal do you ever like write your feelings down or i haven't yet does it mean going around that women watch crime series to relax at night yeah i do actually <laughs> <laughs> i do find it really relaxing my kids think i'm mad but so you've been to therapy uh -huh. okay cool me too me too what kind of therapy have you had uh, well, the company I work for sent me to therapy because I saw some traumatic stuff, so... What, as a child? No, 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 recently, last couple of years. Everybody has the capacity to change. You don't have to, you don't have to let things you've been through define you. And it's okay to heal. Does yeah. your mum put a lot of academic pressure on you? Yeah, a lot, a lot. Why do you think she does that? Because my mum, um, she's from Jamaica. And obviously she had her first child quite young, so she never got to finish her education. So she's... So she wants me yeah. to be the one to finish it, go to uni, to do everything that she never done. Do you have grandkids and stuff? Yeah. Do they help you out and stuff like that? Yeah, especially with the internet. Oh, the internet? Yeah, they help me with that. I have a lot of supportive family. Good. Which, um, Helps. Oh, gosh, yes. You look fly as well, you know. <laughs> you look sick. Give us two lines for black people why they should get therapy. It works. It works. Thank you, man. Bye. Yeah, where's the lawyer's bank here? Um, 